Line. Watch for the green one as they come down the main straight away. There's a green light off and running and Luke Hollyman gets a flyer. We got a bit of a problem with car nine who's got the tail wobbling all over the place but hangs on. Everybody avoids him and charging underneath is Jared Peacock. Charges underneath Luke Hollyman and Peacock goes into the race lead. Still car number nine in all sorts of trouble going back through the pack but our race leader is Jared Peacock to the better of Luke Holliman. Next one through there is our Victorian visitor in Darren Forrest. And then we go to uh, Brad Mendez, long way back then, to uh, Josie Thompson. The interest is up here in positions two, three and four, as Jared Peacock, as he's done previously tonight, is careering away at the race lead Back then, almost losing it, coming out of turn number four. Manages to keep it going in the right direction eventually. But Darren Forrest skips by and goes into position number two as they head down the back chute from Luke Holliman. They've dropped off Brad Mendez a little bit. Josie Thompson would be the next one. Car nine still in trouble. Uh, that's Will Rosa. Finally gets the car back on the racetrack and back in motion the race leader would be the next one on the racetrack that is Jared Peacock careering away from Darren Forrest down the main straightaway goes Jared Peacock the street stock car number 63 really motivating tonight Darren Forrest has got some speed as well then we go back to Luke Holliman chasing him still is Brad Mendes and then we go to Josie Thompson Next one through there would be Justin Jansen to the better of a Dion Wood. And then we're back with our race leader. So, Jared Peacock doing a good job out the front, if anything. Darren Forrest may have closed that gap a little as they go round the western corner and head down the main straight away yet again. The white flag greets Jared Peacock this time. He's got to keep it heading in the right direction for one more lap, Jared Peacock. Chasing him, Darren Forrest, back then to Luke Holliman and Brad Mendez. Round the western corner and Jared Peacock is going to take home the biscuits again in this heat. And Jared Peacock takes the jacket flag and a good win to the better of Darren Forrest. We go back then to Luke Holliman. Then we've got Brad Mendez and then we've got a huge gap with no one in it. I think you'll find it will be Josie Thompson completing the journey next. To the better of a car 27 it is, that's Dion Wood. Still showing everyone all the uh, all the bar work what that goes into the creation of the race car. Jared, another good one, having a good night. Yeah, not too bad. It's a bit wild to drive these things, but no, it's good fun. Thanks again to Pace for letting me drive it and everyone else that's helped out. Okay, looking forward to a national title? Yeah, it'll be different. Um, yeah, I'm looking forward to see what we can do, but they'll probably blow us away. No way. You're a Queenslander. No one can blow you away. There you go, folks. Put your hands together for him. Jared Peacock.